It's time for Jim and stop trading. Oh, there's so much going on. Maybe David has that Nate, that Nate Anderson from Hindenburg thing. I don't want to because I got to go here, but I wish I didn't. Uh, I wanted to talk about Corvo. Uh, Corvo is a big co connectivity supplier to Apple. Now, next to uh, Google, Apple is the one that people think is going to miss. Uh, I do want to point out, just so we know that, and read this great Ray JP, Raymond James. Uh, management now expects Apple revenue to decline in low single digits in fiscal year 2025. What that says is basically, um, well, that Apple's going to miss. And I think that you know, people are going to give you that read through. By the way, Nate Anderson's read through on uh, Charles and SMCI is that NVIDIA is going to do poorly because they have a client that had a lack of commitment to integrity. I'm not buying that one bit. Well, he's not questioning that. Well, actually. he's saying this the is next the guy behind yes. Hindenburg who's, no, who's, I like Nate. Nate's who's great. on uh, the X platform. But he did say that. You read the next saying question. Similar maybe. things to what you and I did about this resignation letter. And right. obviously, I don't need to, him to tell me because we have more experience. But that is one sharply worded letter. But if you want to read. Unlike any that but, I have read in a very long time from a company's former if, auditor. If you want to read through NVIDIA, I would tell you that HPE, which is a big beneficiary here in stocks, be up much, much more. And Dell will take everything that NVIDIA has and cut out Charles, right. Charles Lang. So people want to sell NVIDIA, be my guest. You will be wrong. Apple's tougher. I say own it, don't trade it. But the Corvo news is, is not reassuring. Sure. Yeah, that's a, that's a big drop today. How, so tonight, <laughs> you're gonna get, you tonight? think you can get Rick's to do a double? I'm just stay here, right? It's already tonight. I got Shake Shack when we went over that with right. Rob Lynch. Great numbers. I have Ulta. It's been under, you know, under fire. It's maybe not doing what it should be, but we'll see. And then Bracken Darrell is leading a turn at VF Corp. And he's doing it, by the way, with using North Face, not just fans. I think Bracken comes in from Logitech. He goes to VF, which people thought was going to go bankrupt. And the thing, after like a year, is uh, this is Bracken at his best. Amazing turn. And then I might have David Ricks, although I've not called him or anything, but he needs to come on. Yeah, a 75-minute show, but that's all right. Exactly. He needs, why not? You're going to spend, what, are you doing a 42-hour straight? Walter yeah. Cronkite? What do you got? The <laughs> you mean on an election? Iron, on old, election? Iron pa old Iron Pants? For election Fortunately, week? we have a big team. Yeah. Well, no, the team is you and yeah. then other people. No, no, we got, we got a big team. I know. <laughs> that's the way I like to look at it, because I'm going to come in and pop in. and maybe You are? You're going to pop in? Yeah. I'm yeah. not. As long as he's here, that's all that matters. Did you go to Bronx Science? Like I did the, not go to Bronx Science, no. no Why did you bring Lisa that up? Went I, to Bronx Science. I know, but she was made it from Queens to Bronx Science. That's a long trip every day. <laughs> Jim, we'll see you tonight. Uh, important, important show tonight.